Hello class. Today I'm going to teach you how to do a monologue. I'm going to demonstrate a couple of monologues and give you some tips. So, the first thing you want to do is to make sure that you have a clear focal point to place your other character. It might be a little spot on the wall, it might be the corner of a picture frame, but you want to have a very specific little tiny dot to look at so that you can place your other character there. Okay? You're not going to be consistently looking at it the entire time or staring at it because you're going to be thinking and you might move around a little bit just as long as you don't move out of the frame, that's fine. But you always want to return to that because that's who you're trying to affect. During the monologue, you want to make sure that you are invested in the other character, you're affecting the other character, pursuing IPOs, pursuing a main objective, playing tactics, letting those tactics manifest through body language, body um, energies, and so forth. You also want to play a metaphorical uh, relationship with this other character, too. Okay. So all those acting techniques you're going to put in there. Now, the tactics will give you different beats. When you shift your tactic to a different tactic, you're going to feel a new beat, perhaps, um, or a new IPO. So keep that in mind. Now, you want to frame your monologue. So you want to have the, a beginning introduction, if you will, and a bow at the end. Okay. So you're going to introduce yourself with your name and the character you're playing, the play it's from, and the title of your piece. Okay, for instance, hello, my name is Caroline Good, and I will be play, playing Titania from A Midsummer Night's Dream, and this piece is entitled The Queen. Okay, so then you would want to say that at the beginning of the monologue, go through your monologue, and at the end, you just simply say thank you and do a little bow. Okay, so I'll demonstrate the first one. <clears throat> hello, my name is Caroline Good, and I will be playing Titania from A Midsummer Night's Dream, and this piece is entitled The Queen. <clears throat> Out of this wood do not desire to go. Thou shalt remain here, whether thou wilt or no. I am spirit of no common rate. The summer still doth tend to my state. And I do love thee. Therefore go with me, and I shall fetch thee jewels from the deep, and sing while thou unpressed flowers dost sleep. And I shall purge thy mortal grossness so, that thou shalt like an airy spirit go. Now notice I held the ending there a little bit. You want to hold the ending with a little pause, and then break out and do your bow and say thank you. Okay? So the sex one is uh, a nice fun one from uh, a 12 neck. <clears throat> Hello, my name is Caroline Good, and I will be playing Viola from Twelfth Night. And this piece is entitled, Oh, Pity Me, Please. <clears throat> Make me a willow cabin at your gate, and call upon my soul within the house. Write loyal cantons of contemned love, and sing them loud, even in the dead of night. Hello your name to the reverberate hills, and make the babbling gossip of the air cry out, Olivia. Oh, you would not rest between the elements of air and earth, but you would pity me. Thank you. Okay, so that's uh, essentially how I want you to, to do your monologue. I want you to use some space, use your physicality, get really involved in it play your characters, and do all that in about a minute. So um, I'll be available for questions, obviously, but here you go.